Hey guys, it's Megan, and the Blue Jackets are going to game six tonight at home. Um, they're down 3-2. Um, I have a feeling that they'll, they, they will come back and win tonight. Um, and that those players like Artemi Panarin that were shut down last night will just, you know, be back in the game. Um... What do you think about the fans? Do you think the fans are going to be in the game tonight? Um, yes, I do. <laughs> um, what do the fans need to do? Um, truly, I think just encourage both teams because both teams are great and there's no point in. They need to be louder for the Blue Jackets, though, don't you think? Down the other team, just louder for the Blue Jackets because there's no such thing as too loud at hockey games. Yep. Do you think there's any uh, food the fans should eat tonight? <laughs> no. No. <laughs> How about the Blue Jackets? Do you think there's any special food they should have today before they get going? Ice cream. Ice cream. I'm not sure that's exactly what they want to have. Uh, probably not. <clears throat> I would have ice cream probably, except for I probably wouldn't play that well. So what do you think? Uh, what do you think's gonna step it up today? Um. I think a lot of the players will. Um, there's some players that are play that have been playing their best, um, no matter m what the game is, no matter if we're down, no matter if we're up. Um, some players have just been playing their game all the time. Some players have been going down. Some players have been shut down. Um, but I think all players will be back on their best game. Tonight. What do you think about uh, scoring? Like, we obviously need to score. Um, what do you think you need to do? Well, it would be great if we were first ones to score because um, in hockey, it's one of those things where it's like once your team scores, it's pretty easy to get in the swing of things. If we need to score, we scored, so now let's score again. And it's more of a just like a start off to all the scoring. Yeah. What about taking shots? Do you have any advice on taking shots? Um, well, we usually have people hanging back door, but what the Capitals don't know is that they don't guard back door. Um, is, yeah, they just don't guard back door, so if we had people that were hanging out back door, um, or like just spreading everything wide, like really wide, taking, like passing is one of the major things for the Blue Jackets. Um, we do a lot of that. Um, you know, I think shooting will be um, a pretty easy thing for them tonight. So, yeah. Any advice on taking shots? Um. You miss any shots? Take any shots? Um, I would say just take shots because I mean, truly, you miss 100% of the shots you don't take, but you only miss 40, 50% of the shots that you do take. So if they take shots, they'll most likely make more shots and score more goals and everything. Any predictions for the score tonight? Um, Jack, do you have a prediction? You said I don't care. Okay, Jack doesn't care. <laughs> um, I have a feeling inside me that we're going to win and that we'll score at least three goals within first and second. Um, I feel like we're gonna win like five to two or five to three. That's my prediction. Five to three. There it is. All right, bring them home. Any message you want to send them before the game tonight? Um, be courageous. Um, have courage in your team because if you let your team down, um, it's more of a, just a thing where it's like if you say something negative, something negative will happen. Say something. You know, just non negative, positive. I don't know. Um, your team will be positive on each other and they'll work positive. So just be courageous, have courage in each other, believe in each other, just trust each other that each other will be there because, you know, they most likely, they all know where they should be and they're all usually where they're supposed to be. So if you trust, that one person's here, one person's there, then, I mean, if you pass the puck, they should be there for you. Um, yeah. All right.
Go Jackets. What?